Hello everyone, welcome. This is Feline Intuition 1111. This is going to be a collective reading. Let's see what messages want to come out for you. What are the messages for the collective? You've got mask. Okay, let's see. Intuition. Your intuition is going to unmask someone or someone's feelings. We've got magnetic attraction. We've got between the lines. Yeah, you're uncovering someone's true colors or true feelings with your intuition. It could be that they've been secretly attracted to you. Let me see. What are the messages? Oh, okay. All right. We got, okay. We got somebody hiding their feelings for you. All right. I always feel like someone's watching me. Be careful of fake pages. We got soulmates, we got spiritual cleanse, and we got forever my lady, eternal love, marriage, proposal, pregnancy, empress, reciprocity. So, hmm, someone's hiding how they feel about you. Let's see. What are the messages for the collective? What are the messages? the messages for the collective wheel of fortune ooh the hangsman okay what is this Okay, we've got you kind of moving out of some kind of situation into, like, you're moving out of a bad situation into a good one. Okay, sorry about that. There was some noise outside. So, a lot of you are going through major change right now. I feel like you're moving away from a certain type of jealous, gossipy energy. Um, you're definitely moving away from these types of people, or maybe you're just distancing yourself from them no longer speaking to them or entertaining what they have to say because i see you moving into really good energy like blessings especially when it comes to love as well there is some kind of soulmate connection happening um someone is going to be gossiping about the fact that you you have this nine of cups like your wishes are coming true and i'm seeing a few people show up here that don't like it but I see you kind of moving away from them with the Six of Swords, like moving away from that type of energy. Why the Wheel of Fortune? The Sun in Reverse. Yeah, you're moving away from negative people. Or just ignoring them completely. Because <laughs> I feel like you see your blessings coming in. Some of you are manifesting these things. Clarify the... Hangman, please. Yeah, there's this constant energy I'm seeing of moving out of or moving away from people. So you're going to be seeing things differently. And I feel like you're going to be more drawn to people who support you and congratulate you. Someone's going to be offering you a connection. I do see someone who is hiding their feelings. Clarify this Queen of Wands in reverse, please. Why is this here? Be careful of either a friend from the past or some new person who wants to be your friend. They are a Queen of Wands in reverse, which means they gossip. They don't really like you or they could be envious of you. But with the page of wands, I see them communicating with you. So it could be this person wearing the mask. Because it's like they're communicating with you or they're communicating with you again after not communicating with you for some time. But they are showing up as the queen of wands in reverse. So they're not, their intentions are not pure with you, but they're acting like they are. Why the nine of cups? It does seem to be surrounding, surrounding. <laughs> 
it does seem to be surrounding the things that you're getting so some of you are getting some kind of financial improvement maybe there was um stagnancy but that's changing you're going from having a financial issue to the nine of cups and again with the three of wands you're definitely seeing this come in some of you are manifesting it clarify the four of pentacles in reverse yeah you're letting go of certain people who lie and just are fake why this queen queen why the king of cups in reverse Some of you have an emotionally manipulative ex that you're finally letting go of. They could have told a lot of lies. You could be finally getting over them. Yeah. There was a lot of emotional manipulation and lies with this person. They could be a Virgo, a Leo, Taurus. Why the Four of Swords? There's conflict ending between you and someone you were on a break with. It doesn't have to be the same manipulative ex. It could be someone else. There's someone that you're making peace with or you guys stop talking for a bit. It could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But with the moon in reverse, for some of you, if the person who's going to reveal their true feelings for you is someone you already know, it's definitely someone um, recent who you may have stopped speaking to. They may come forward and confess their feelings. I feel like they've been hiding a lot of feelings with the intuition, the mask and magnetic attraction, and now the moon in reverse. Could be a Pisces. Sorry about the noise outside again. Okay, why strength in reverse? Who is this though? Someone's, this could be a ex because they're feeling. Unstable. They're wanting someone to make them happy. So this could be someone who kind of relies on people for happiness or attention. They rely on attention. Someone is feeling low without your attention. Feeling like there's no forward movement with you. It could be a Cancer, Leo. Taurus, Virgo. Let me look at the main spread because that was like a lot of messages. Let's see what else comes out. Okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what in the world? Okay, what are the messages for the collective? What are the messages? If someone's going to reveal their true feelings. Ace of Swords. High Priestess, they feel like you guys have a spiritual connection, strength card, they view you, ooh, this is good. King of Cups upright, finally. Queen of Cups, Queen of Pentacles upright. You are fixing a financial situation and you could be meeting someone very nurturing and loving as well. Or someone's going to be that way towards you. It could be someone you already know or someone that you meet. But this Queen of Pentacles in the position of what you need to know is very good. You're going to be very cushy is what I'm hearing. Cushy. <laughs> You're going to be very comfortable in love and in finances. Why this? the Ace of Swords? Could be dealing with an Aries, a Leo. Someone's been holding back. 
They've been standing in their own way, holding back their feelings for you. Their mind has been blocking them. They've been creating fear where there's no fear. This person is going to get over their fears and tell you how they feel. Whoever they are. Why the High Priestess? This may happen soon. Ooh. You got two people in pursuit of you. Two people are trying to pursue a relationship with you. You got two people. And I strongly feel this. Actually seeing themselves in a relationship with you. So you might have... <laughs> You might have one person express their feelings and then you might have another person express their feelings like around you like, oh, wait a minute, both of you. <laughs> um, but there's this high priestess. It's like they view you as this very divine spiritual person, wise, knowledgeable, and they're pursuing you. For some of you, your soulmate could be one of them. For, for others of you, it could be none of them because they are showing up as knights. And in pursuit of the high priestess, careful that these are just not like broken people needing to heal. I don't really get that fully, but I would put out that um, warning just in case. So look out for immaturity, basically, is what I want to say. If they come off immature, then they're just, they need to heal and they're looking to lean on you for that. But if you meet someone who's mature and in pursuit of you, then yeah, that's different. So, okay, that emperor just done a spin all the way around. So we'll see what that was about. But let me see, why the strength? Someone who is trying to test you or try to test you or will try to test you sees you as strong AF. Because they failed. They could have tried to play mind games. It could be someone new. Sometimes, you know, these days you'll go on a date with someone and they'll try to play mind games right away. It could be something like that or it could be a past person. But someone is viewing you as very strong because the mind games didn't work. They got nowhere with it, with the Knight of Pentacles. And they just, <laughs> they could be one of these knights because they see you as just the high priestess in the strength card where they couldn't get around you. Now it's like, okay, maybe I can learn something from this person or maybe this person is right for me. They could, you know, be a great partner, but I would be careful with someone who tried to play games in the first place. Why the... Oh my gosh. Could be a Scorpio for some of you. <laughs> Alright. Why the Ten of Pentacles in reverse? Okay, my apologies. Definitely got a bit noisy. So, I'm seeing with this Ten of Swords... With someone wishing for the Ten of Pentacles in reverse, for some of you, this could either be an ex who does not want you to move on or become like, or be in a committed connection, committed relationship, or it's that same person from the beginning who is envious of you being in this Nine of Cups energy, getting all your wishes. Someone is wishing failure for you, but it's not going to happen as long as you know who is who behind their masks why the page of swords in reverse two of wands you are working really hard. Oh, there's a competitive energy here. Whatever you're working on um, financially or maybe physically or working on yourself, someone has a fear of where this is going to take you. They feel like 
they're going head to head with you. Page of Swords in reverse. They could be speaking negatively about you. This could be why spiritual cleansers here. There is, there is this negative energy trying to creep in. This emperor keeps wanting to spin around. Clarify the king of cups, please. There's going to be this person. For some of you, it could be someone who you've gotten over, who's going to try to offer you love, and you might reject their offer. With the ace of wands in reverse, clarify the page of cups, please. Strength. You may have a past person who sees other people offering you love. They see this as a block, but they're trying to act like, ugh, they're trying to act like they don't have feelings for you. I see multiple people. I see a past person and I see people in pursuit of you, like new people. The past person is trying to maintain their pride and trying not to chase you because they see other people trying to get your attention or talking about you. And they're trying to act like they are the, you know, they're trying to act like they're above your other options because they've been with you before. Or they're above anyone who tries to be with you. Clarify the Eight of Pentacles in reverse, please. You got careful of someone who tries to come towards you without any effort this reading is such a mixture of energies you got someone here trying to come towards you to get get something out of you with little to no effort it does look like a past energy could be one of these nights could be a cancer aries why the Queen of Pentacles? Oh my goodness. Hold on. Okay. Someone's gonna be... Someone's gonna be offering you a lot. They're gonna be taking on your burdens. You got help coming in. So like the connection that you're going to be in or if you are in a connection, I see them being more helpful because like I said earlier, you're going to be comfortable. So it's like someone's taking up your load so that you can be comfortable. Clarify the, the emperor in reverse, please. King of Pentacles, fool in reverse. I see a past person becoming possessive of you because you have this very, this could be a king of pentacles, male or female. We do have the king and queen of pentacles. Whoever this is, they are about stability and nurturing. And so this ex who is acting like they're better than your other options, they're going to be very jealous and feeling possessive because they see you being treated in the way they couldn't treat you. Or they couldn't afford to treat you. They may have needed healing. They may have not been financially stable. But they see you getting some type of treatment. So it's kind of like, why are you acting like you're all that when you couldn't even do what this new person is doing? Hmm. So they're going to be very... Their ego is going to be very um, affected. What are the messages for the collective? <laughs> what did I say about these nights? Chasing, pursuit, toxicity, resilience. So keep in mind the word toxicity is there and I do feel like someone tried to play mind games or will try to, but you'll overpower them and you'll um, show them that you can't be played with is what I'm seeing and they'll see that, but they'll still be chasing you because that only makes them feel like you're more of a challenge.
Lusting, forbidden, non-committal as the actual energy. Yeah, careful of these knights. I'm not saying I'm not saying that that's the personality of everyone who comes towards you, but there's definitely some foul energy there. Fantasy, daydreaming, imagining, fantasize, longing, craving, aching, wanting. I feel like a lot of people are wanting you, but and it's mainly going towards that ex, but they have all this pride. They don't want to look desperate. What are the messages for the collective? Discontent, uneasy, unhappy. Okay, this card came out. Can't show the image, but it says growth, spiritual awakening, removing masks, which... From the beginning, I said that you're seeing through people's masks. Opportunity, new roads ahead. Bad at love. Careful of one of these knights trying to play their game and then in the end talking about how they're just bad at love. They are just fake okay we got investigating looking for evidence graves you made your bed now lay in it so that's the message to the ex who is longing for you right now they made their bed they could have come forward but they have too much pride serious relationship union marriage partnership Blonde female, money, wealth, luck, finances. I told you, you're going to be comfortable. Career, success, business, achievement, sorry, advancement. Past life, knowing, deja vu, past love. Who's investigating? Who's looking for evidence? You may have an ex who's looking to see if you're still mad at them. Like I said, there's like a there's someone who wants to come in with low effort. They could be trying to see if you if you're not mad at them anymore, so they don't have to apologize and all of that. They're watching. They're the they're the ones watching with the fake account, the page of swords in reverse. They're trying to look for evidence that you may not be mad at them anymore so they can come forward effortlessly without having to apologize. I'm also seeing this energy of this fake friend who wants to come in either from the past or a person who wants to make friends with you who again does not have the nine of cups that you have. They're showing up as the queen of pentacles in reverse. They showed up as the queen of wands in reverse before. Um... What if I discontent, uneasy, unhappy? Some people are going to be unhappy. There's going to be a lot of jealousy. When the queens are in reverse, there's a lot of jealousy. We have the queen of wands in reverse twice now. Queen of cups in reverse. Queen of pentacles in reverse. Just, we, only, we, only, we just don't have the queen of swords. But we have three queens in reverse. And it's surrounding your success. So there's going to be people jealous that it's not them. Being looked at, being pursued. Even though some of these options are ridiculous. They're just not like the best options. People are still going to envy the fact that they want you and not them. So be careful of someone who tries to make friends with you. Clarify the fake pages, please. someone who feels rejected so x energy is watching with the fake page they feel like you're not giving them any attention anymore they're trying to find a way in without it um affecting their pride what are the messages for the collective Someone new. 
open up body language read the body language of these knights who come towards you we got don't give up friends to lovers and past love Ooh, so we got past love someone new friends to lovers who are you going to be with you could have a lot of new people coming towards you but you could end up pursuing someone who's been a friend to you or will start off as a friend because you gotta be aware of the toxic ones that are like trying to pursue they're in it for the chase what are the messages for the collective comic someone better stand your ground inevitable closure so you may get closure from this ex or maybe they're looking for closure from you they definitely feel like you've moved on from them or gotten over them you're standing your ground with these people and that's why they view you as untouchable clarify someone better please yeah, you got someone someone who doesn't lie about their feelings quite open could be a scorpio but they do show up as a sun could be a leo but it just seems like they're very pure i want to say they're a light so you'll be able to see through the darkness of these options who pursue you with you know their self themselves in mind or something to gain but there's someone who is very much light energy who wants to take on any burden you have wants to help wants to nurture they could be very financially stable too and you got this ten of cups coming in some of you might find this connection burdening, meaning it may be something you're not used to. Maybe you're not used to asking for help or accepting help or accepting or receiving in general. So it may be like, you may, some of you may have to adjust to this, but they are coming in. Um, Clarify soulmates. There's this is funny because you the soulmate could be a past person, not for all of you, but this I'm also seeing that your past person could think they're a soulmate or think that you're their soulmate even after you've moved on. Because the ten of pentacles in reverse. They could be wanting you to break up with this person that you're with or that you're going to be with. Because we've got the Ten of pen Pentacles in reverse twice. And it's in somebody's wishes as well. And we've got the Three of Cups in reverse, which is third party energy. So they could be wanting to, wanting you to end things with a new person or current person so that they could be with you. They could be realizing or thinking that you're their soulmate now after you've gotten over them that's why i say for some of you you might have a past person come forward and you might reject them because you don't really resonate with them anymore others of you could be with them if that's what you're wanting but i do see rejection when it comes to an ex like you rejecting them being over them but that's up to you there's definitely a connection though could be a leo could be a Leo again, Taurus, Cancer, Aries, Aries twice. Um, got Libra, Le Leo again. Aquarius. Capricorn. Those are the main signs. So I hope this was helpful. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.